Hello Twin Flames and welcome to this reading. It's Christmas Eve's Eve today so send you so much love and if you are new to the channel welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. So let's do a check in and see what's coming in today. Obviously things are heating up, there's a lot of passion around right now so what's the energy? Thank you Angel. So we're going to bring in the Twin Flame message tarot. So what's the energy? What do we need to know? What's happening today, please, angels, with the twins? Wow, jumped out the deck there. What's the energy around the divine feminines today? And the energy around the divine masculines today? Wow, jumped out the deck. Look at this for the masculine. Two of cups, you are meant for each other. So the masculine is saying to you, you were meant for me. They're giving me that song, you were meant for me. Okay, I don't know who it's by or what it is, but you were made for me. So... You're made for each other and you're meant for each other. And that's really what you need to know today. The Two of Cups is about the beautiful partnership that you, you share, you know, the bond, the love. But it's also about the friendship because you are best friends united in love. You know, the friendship that you have is the glue that holds it together. The fact that you can communicate and be with each other and share love. And that's how it should be. And that's what it's like in union. So this is kind of a preview of what's to come here. And we've got the Page of Swords. It says, delays in communication are not forever. Let go and focus on you. And this is the divine masculine energy. So remember, if he's not messaging you right now, if he's ignoring you right now, don't take it personally. It's not forever. You know, let go and focus on you. So I feel he's busy right now with his 3D world because of what's happening with Christmas time and with his job and all these things. And what he's saying is, even if I'm not messaging you, you're meant for me. We're meant to be together. And this is real, very powerful. The energy of the divine feminine opening up to each other. So you know it's coming. Regardless of any delay around communication, you're opening up to each other. And this is what's happening. You know, I know a lot of you have been sharing time together and, you know, having these little coffee shop meetups and communicating, even if you're doing it online with, you know, a hot drink, you're connecting, you're opening up to each other, you're expressing love because it's also the time of year, it's the time of giving. So you know that your masculine is on their way, regardless of any delays in communication, you are understanding and accepting that Christmas is a busy time and that's okay. Feminine for you, we've got judgment. It says, love everyone equally, for we are all one. And this is something we're learning as a divine feminine too, to love one another, as Jesus said, as I have loved you. Love everyone equally, for we are all love. So I feel this is about spending time with loved ones. You know, it's Christmas Eve's Eve, so you may already be spending time with loved ones right now. You may be seeing family right now. And sometimes we get judged by our family because they don't understand the journey. They think we're going crazy. They want us to be happy. So they say things like, oh, you know, why don't you go on a dating app? Or why don't you go on a date or meet someone? Or, you know, or you get judged by people in couples saying, oh, you know, why haven't you got children? Or why aren't you with anyone? Or people just don't get it. So remember, don't judge them. They're doing the best they can. So they're only seeing it from their perception. Rise above and breathe and focus on love. So try and see it from a higher point of view. We've also got for the connection, the hanged man. Delays are necessary to lead to the desired outcome. Change your perception. So again, if there's any delays in communication today, trust that it's all happening for your higher good. You're give, being given that rainbow there for a reason. The rainbow is about protection and strength too. So the angels are asking you to trust in the power of love, to trust the, the spiritual bond that you share, your psychic awareness of everything here, because it's truly meant to be. So change your perception. The delays are necessary to lead to the desired outcome. And what's the desired outcome? It's your union. It's you to be together because you're meant to be together. So trust the delays are happening for your higher good. And we've got celebrations ahead. Look at this reunion expect reunion and the celebration is reminding you we're in a festive period right now it's an opportunity to be excited to give to yourself to feel good and you know jingle bells magic coming in so again this is showing me the energy of the fireworks with the new year and we celebrate the new year with fireworks so it's about celebrations 
enjoying getting through the Christmas time because you're truly meant to be. And look at this, a time of reflection and healing. So you're both meditating right now and connecting on the 5D and you're both mirroring each other too. So I feel you're connecting in dreams, you're connecting anyway, you're feeling each other energetically and you're both mirroring this energy. And he sees you as very graceful, very loving, very kind. And he's kind of dreaming about you right now because he can see and feel, you know, your compassion and your empathy and your strength. So this is very powerful because everything that's happening right now is bringing in the right healing and the right timing for your journey. Very beautiful. We're also going to bring in the Divine Feminine 101. So what else is going on with you today, Divine Feminine? We've got I hope you change. And you may be thinking that today, you know, I hope you change. I hope it's not going to be the same thing again next year. I hope you change because it hurts without you. So even though you're feeling all this power and excitement and this gratitude for the love and you know things are moving forward, you still hurt. It still hurts being without them at this time of year. But you see all the signs and the signs tell you it's real. So the angels are saying, pay attention to the signs today. The signs are guiding you on. And I want everything with you. Let me give you it all. And that's what you want. And, you know, this is so powerful because before me and George were in union, I wanted to give all of my all. You know, I wanted to give everything, especially at Christmas time, because previously I'd always given and, you know, given everything as we do as a divine feminine and not really got much back. You know, all through my life, really, I've been like that, giving to others. But with George... Everything I give to him, he gives to me. And the angels are reminding you of that. So I know that you have all this love you want to give, all this beautiful energy. You know, you want to shower them with gifts and shower them with love and be with them. That's coming. Does it really matter if it's this Christmas or next Christmas? It's coming in. And, you know, when you are happy with what you have now, magic happens. So even if you're not together this Christmas time, and some of you are, but if you're not, it's coming. You're going to be able to give to them. And when you do, they are going to give everything back to you too. And can we meet up and talk this out? So remember, as a divine feminine, we want to clear the air. We want to control that sometimes. We want to sort it out. And the angels are asking you to release and let go, to give it to heaven. Because at the right time, you'll meet up and talk. And you will clear the air. So if there's any stress energy around talking and, you know, hearing from your twin, then let go of that. Because I feel there's going to be a divide here. I feel some of you divine feminines are in communication right now. Okay. And it's good communication. You know, you're communicating and you're opening up to each other and you're feeling the love. Some of you that the communication isn't there yet. So it's still delayed. Or if they are communicating with you, there's delays around it and it's nothing to take personal because they're dealing with their own stuff so don't take it personal don't try and force anything to happen you know thinking oh I need to sort this out I need to clear the air I want to talk to you just let them come to you because they will they always do so let it breathe release relax remember they are dealing with judgment too there's things in their life they've got going on too it can be a very hectic crazy time of year because we're dealing with family and family sometimes don't you know understand they're there to trigger us to heal us they're there to grow us to teach us you know my sister is probably my biggest trigger but she's also one of my greatest soul teachers so if someone is triggering you in your family breathe and rise above it and remember this is what the masculines are going through too and remember a lot of the masculines are stuck in karmic situations so they're going to be feeling you know it's like their head's about to explode so they don't need pressure from anyone else especially the divine feminine what they need from you right now is compassion understanding and love so just focus on you that's what your masculine is asking you to do today he's saying to you delays in communication He's saying, I'm sorry I'm not communicating with you today, but it's not forever. Let go today and focus on you. So he's asking you to focus on him. Well, he, he wants you to focus on him. Okay, that's what he wants you to do. And he'll never stop wanting you to focus on him. And that just come through. And that sometimes can shock him 
because he's thinking, well, I want you to focus on you, but obviously I want you to focus on me and you'll still be focused on him anyway. But let him do what he's doing and you focus on you. Give to you, enjoy doing you today, focus on what you've got to do and let him come back to you because he's saying it's late, not forever because we are truly meant to be. Have a great day, sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.